summer. It's gonna be a really dope wellness experience, full cultural immersion trip, seeing all the sights in Tanzania. Just like a once in a lifetime experience for those who don't wanna to come to Tanzania, but maybe don't wanna come on their own and they just kinda of wanna like just show up and just have things done for them. Um, it's definitely gonna be a full soul wellness experience in Tanzania. I'm so excited about it. And I have one of, if not, no, I have the best Tanzanian travel influencer who's gonna be our guide on this experience. He has traveled all over Tanzania. He's just made it his business to know everything about Tanzania, traveling, um, he's my little brother. I've adopted him for sure. <laughs> it was busy. Mm -hmm. Just saying we just had a adult meeting wrapping up. Yeah, we should, we should, man. I'm glad to see you. Uh, it's been a great one. Congratulations with the progress. <laughs> Huge progress, man. Uh, yeah. No, I was just saying how we're playing this trip. Yeah, this trip, oh, this trip, uh, it's actually the progress too, you know, because if we came from not knowing how much to getting to where we are, to knowing the itinerary, to knowing how exciting this trip is going to be for the people that are planning to travel with us, uh, to me this is like a big milestone, so can't wait to, that's why I'm excited to share the images so that we can just go ahead and start advertising it, yeah. and I believe once it's out there, with the things that we're planning to offer and the experience that we're planning to give all the travelers, I believe it will attract a majority of people who want to explore Africa and getting to see the diverse part of it, you know, because we're going to be showing culture, the landscape and the beauty of it, the wildlife safari, the beach experience with its cultural Swahili people in Zanzibar. And most definitely, you know, um, the healing and just the meditation, the relaxation that people want to get out of this. It's just going to be proper mentally, you know, physically and spiritually. It's going to make people feel full. Their soul is going to be very full <laughs> <laughs> after this safari, I'm telling you. Yeah, yeah I appreciate you. Yeah. I didn't even feel, film earlier, but I was at Carrier Co. all day. And then I went to the flower market. I actually just got this little bouquet made because I'm working on a friend's baby shower. I just got a little baby. Oh, the process. So, and I'm also waiting on a new table for my dining room with this bouquet of going once it gets here so i need to um actually call the guy right now let me call him so y'all can see what we're dealing with <laughs> no but like in tanzania you really have to be patient because things never come when they say they're supposed to come um I'm supposed to get this table saturday it's now wednesday and i went there yesterday they had it even like finish sanding, finish um, putting the varnish on, putting the frame on, anything. So he said it was supposed to be ready today. Let's see. Hello. Hi, Kaka. Hi, how are you? Good, how are you? I'm fine, fine. So, what's up? Are you at home, are you at home now? Yes. I'm coming. It's ready? I'm coming. Uh, it's ready. Did you come here or we wait, wait, wait for you? You can bring for me. Okay, I'm coming. Oh, so I'll send you my address. Uh, it's across the street. Sorry, you know that when you go out to your home, so I don't have to So I prepare everything, then it's starting to go at your home. Oh, okay. So you, you think like maybe seven or eight, like later today? It's going to get delivered? Yeah. Okay, Salah. Okay. 
he says it's gonna be here. So it's six now. We'll see, but I actually need to of it like I want the pillows to be bright like I just I'm very very particular now and I've never been this way I don't know where this version of me came from but I really know that at least for my healing journey my home environment has been a huge impact on my ability to heal to be able to come home and feel like it's a um you know, a sanctuary or a retreat away from the world where you can just be yourself and relax and calming. That is essential, essential. Like it is a deal breaker. Like I have to, I have to have it. It also helps um, here that I have help with, with my space. Like I have a daughter, she comes three days a week. It also helps cause you know, I have um, guests that are in and out, so. Um, but that has really allowed some of the stress, um, actually a lot of the stress off of my shoulders to be able to just come home to a nice clean environment every day. Um, there's so much work that has to be done to maintain your home. And I just know, at least for right now, this part of the journey, it's just nice to um, have help. Yeah, so I'm grateful for that. Here, you guys are guys, so fast. I'm so tired, you know? huh? You guys are so tired. It's coming. The stairs. It's a lot of stairs. I know. You guys, you guys got here fast.
This is Wazir. Yeah. What's the name of your shop? Your shop called. Shop called. Your, sh your wood shop called. The name. Ah, uh, coastal, coastal furniture. Coastal. Uh, coastal furniture. So look, you. Uh, something like this. Yeah. Can touch in here. Mm. Ah, my wall. Coastal. Coastal furniture. And Oyster Bay. What's? And Oyster Bay. Oyster Bay. Okay, so. Thank you.